We've reported on this before, a house in Southeast Portland for sale with squatters living inside. As of this week, it officially sold. And the people are out. Elise Haas following up on the story tonight. Elise, you met with the new owner and you actually got a tour? I did. I got to walk inside that house and I will tell you it was there's a lot to be left to desired because there's a lot of work that needs to be done. But it was about a month ago when I first told you guys about how there was this house that was for sale, as is with people living inside of it, and that the original owner couldn't get the people out. So today I met with the man who was working to fix this neighborhood's problem. Cade Gardner gave us a tour of the house near Southeast 52nd in Flavel that he just bought with the help of a lender. Uh, when I came down here the first time, there was, there was stuff all over the place that actually looked completely different than this. There was uh, tires to cars, there was rims, um, just about anything you could think of was covering the floor. He's a realtor and he's already working on flipping this mess. It's satisfying um, just kind of seeing a home go from um, just distressed and nobody really wants to live there. and. So being able to turn it into a home that a new family can move into. Normally, you can't get a loan to buy a distressed home like this. That's why it often takes an investor willing to come in, clear it out, and fix it back up. So it was, it was kind of a nightmare over there. Neighbors are relieved Cade is stepping in to help. You know, it booted everybody out, and you're just like, finally. <laughs> Something good is happening over there, you know? Things are looking up. It'll be nice to have a normal neighborhood again. <laughs> While making the purchase, Cade says he introduced himself to the people living there and helped coordinate them moving out. I was a little bit worried about them just kind of getting out of the house and then just roaming the streets and um, yeah, yep. So I made sure that they had another place to go and whether it was with friends or family or anything like that. As this door closes on this part of the story, Kate says a prettier one will open when this house is up for sale again soon. So Kate told me that his plan is to have the home refinished and up for sale within the next three months. And he says that if anyone else in the area is experiencing a problem like this, that he's willing to help. I also had a chance to talk to the realtor who helped sell this problem house. He told me that the owner is happy and ready to move forward in his life. Live in Southeast Portland, Elise Haas, Quintix News.